guess where we are? Do you remember the video that I made about the warehouse sale, which was actually the church sale, and everybody in the comments was saying overpriced, overpriced? Well, they are having another sale, and this is day two of their sale, so once again, I'm hoping that we can get some deals. It's everything from estate sales that they've hosted and they are now trying to get rid of, right? So we should be seeing some low prices, some fair prices. Let's get in there. You guys tell me what you think in the comments. Is it fair price or not? Let's go. Okay. So 25% off today. But again, that just depends on if it was overpriced to begin with. Greetings. Morning. Welcome. Thank you. Everything's 25% Great, thank you very much. Okay. Awesome. Okay, thank you very much. This is a very cute caned rocker. Wow, this is nice. Don't need a rocker, but 60 bucks. Nice drawings. <laughs> This is a nice uh, nesting tables, 165. Oh, they're a bit wobbly. Yeah, they're mahogany. They're pretty. So 165 with 25 percent off. This is everything. So we'll just start on the outside and make our way around. This lamp's only 24. Prices so far, not that bad. Would love to find a cool mid century modern lamp, but not seeing one so far. This is a neat little lamp. So twenty five percent off. Spools. Wait, there's green slashes and then there's red dots. Now I don't remember. <laughs> I think everything is 25% off. Funny, if you guys remember, this yellow wear was here before, I think. And they still haven't sold it. Yep, $85 on this bowl.
Look at this. Oh wow, and you put a candle in it. It's a tea lamp, $30. on items with a green slash but it doesn't say anything about the red dot hmm. nice pottery pieces I got it from Carol Carol Somebody sent it to her. <laughs> I, I, this I is nice. Thought, you know, $20. Here's another one. Oh, I'm not going to grab it. <laughs> These are nice. Quilts. This table runner is pretty. Not even been used. Eighteen dollars. Yeah, I think it might be too big. Little tree. I can't remember. I can't remember. Nice linens. These are all like two dollars. Hand towels, three dollars. Napkins, two dollars. Yeah, some of the stuff I remember from the last sale, and it didn't sell. $20 on these old brushes, combs. $45 on the coffee grinder. No sale, well, 25% off, I guess. Rolling pin, 12 The spoon is 10 and then there's some old fall stuff here. Thanksgiving. Magazines. Yeah, because the last sale, this was full of books. So they have turned over some stuff. Not that many books. This is ten dollars, so almost a complete set. Eight dollars. This looks like a little spoon rest. It's pretty. Old Coca Cola stuff. Pampered Chef. Looks like stoneware at first. 
but you can almost feel Pampered Chef stuff is like gritty. Yeah, it just feels like sandpaper or stoneware usually has a glaze. Some vintage cutlery. $35 for all of it. Lots of glass and crystal. Let's check out this picture in the back. This is really pretty. Oh my gosh. Steel engraving. $95. Yeah. No, at their home. It says copyrighted by Rad Lochner, 1893. This is a really pretty picture. The frame is so nice. Okay, I'm gonna look this one up. Okay, 240. 145, 150, 195. It should be on sale as well. 95 on sale. Let's confirm. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. Hi, everything is 25% off, right? right. Uh -huh. Even if it doesn't have like a, a dot or anything like that. Uh -huh. Okay, cool, thank you. Sure, and if you wanna, um, we have a whole table. Okay, I can set it back there. Thank you very much. It's to the right in the hallway. Okay, thank you. Okay, perfect. This picture is 95, but 25% off. Totally getting it. Oh, like, do you guys remember these? I was looking at getting these last time. I think they're even, even bigger than that. And this basket is 75. But 25% off. It seems like baskets for some of you guys are saying way overpriced, some of you are saying fair price. This is 75. It feels old. An old sled, too. The old sled's $40. Awesome. I'm going to get this picture. So pretty in there. Hello there. Hi, how are you doing there? Are you ready to check out? Yes. Do I need to tear the bottom off for you? Yeah, if you don't mind. Of course. There we go. Thank you. So it says it's from 1893. That's right. It's really pretty. 25% off thanks it's 71 and a quarter today. And the tax on that is four dollars and twenty-eight cents. Seventy-five dollars and sixty-three cents altogether. It's nice, yeah, I love the frame. The frame is really, really pretty. Yeah. There's um it's an old Williamsburg print in there too that has a very similar kind of frame. Oh, okay. Yeah. I got a picture at your last sale as well. Oh, and fill out one of these for our customer appreciation. Name and phone number for our draw. 
That, that ticket just goes in that vase there for the, that's the way you could possibly win. Oh, I'm okay, thank you. Okay. I appreciate it though. Give somebody else a chance. Thanks so much. Thank you. Have a great day. Thank you for coming by. Thank you. This happened to me last time too, where I came out the back door, but I'll show it to you right now. Boom. Look at that picture, so pretty. It's, it's very hard for me to try to find really nice prints that are the right tone that I like, kind of more sepia, uh, and then with a really nice frame so that I don't have to do anything. I don't have to remat it. I don't have to reframe it. It's just ready to hang. And it even has the hook on the back, ready to go. Perfect. All right, so what do you guys think? Are the prices fair? I mean, some of the stuff I do remember seeing from the last sale and it was still kind of high priced, especially for being left over from what months at this point. Um, but I guess they must have overpaid on some of this stuff. And so they are just sticking to getting those prices back. They had some cute lights in there, but it's just none of it was really for me. And again, I buy for my personal home and then for a certain style that I like in my shop. So I'm taking you with me. Hopefully you saw some stuff in there that maybe you thought was nice and priced pretty fairly. Um, that's kind of what we get here in Virginia. Let me know if the prices are in line of what you see where you live. I was really happy though with my picture. And if you remember at the last sale, which I can put the video up here if you want to reference that one. I bought that one picture that everybody said was either great price or really common and overpriced. Um, this picture I got today though, I did look it up and it is almost triple the price online. And again, when you're buying something for yourself, sometimes it's not about the price if it's for yourself. So I loved that picture and what I was willing to pay was what it was priced at, which is $95. I mean, if you go to Home Goods or Target, I mean, they've got stuff that's like printed, made in China, and they're charging you 50, 60, $70 for it. So this picture, regardless of if it's a reprint, if it's a drawing, there's not that many of them. You can't buy it at the shop. And I liked it personally for the scene, the frame, the fact that it's already matted, it's ready to hang, love it. And it was on 25% off. So just got the picture for today. Could have probably left with a few other things, but I don't wanna buy just to buy, you know, I have to really like it. And so I'm really happy with my picture today. Um, thanks for following along with me and I hope you enjoyed it and see you in the next one.